Okay, here's my latest uh, battery refresher. It's the flattest that I've built and I've hooked it on 12.9 volt. Okay, and you can see I have a voltmeter attached to uh, the capacitor and if you watch when it goes up to 11.5 volts and then it flashes then it discharges the capacitor but only to like 10, 9 something just below 10 that's the time that it just shorts the collector and the emitter of the transistor and uh, essentially creating a, sh a very short period of short circuit between the on the battery terminals um, I've put this tape because this is the, con the, uh, the the back surface of the transistor is the collector and I don't want this to short so just put this tape this is not heating up at all okay so every five seconds there's like a small burst of current so really nothing Okay, and here it is with the battery clips on, the crocodile clips, okay, and yeah, it's flashing, oops, every few seconds, okay, here's the previous one, I think this is the first one I made, and actually this, um, the LED that I've used here, it's much brighter so you can see it much easily it also comes on slowly it's probably consuming much more on this side I've got one too this is my um, water pump uh, power pack for the uh, solar heater or pool water heater so uh, I also have one here it's flashing every few seconds Bing. Okay, so that's pretty much it. I know I actually had built this one prior, but it uh, it only works above twelve and a half volts, so will be moderately useful. But I uh, probably have to change. I'll try and change this um, the the transistor. That, that that we use as a diode. I hope that's sufficient. But that was the previous design and it's fairly compact but now I've sort of flattened the uh the LED and and uh resistor and I flattened also the well not didn't flatten this uh, the the cap. So anyway, that's it.